Hey. What's up? Right, chat. I be running through them red lights. I don't stop at night. I got demons and they out for me. They coming for my life. I don't stop at night. It's Marley Mitch. What's up? I be running through them red lights. I ain't stopping night. I got demons in the And it is the next day, bro. Listen, last night was goofy, bro. I don't understand, bro. Like, what kind of drugs these people be on? Big track out season. Y'all, that, that bitch crazy. Yes, sir, brother. That bitch hard. That bitch so clean. I got no change, bro.
knife in the mood. Not trying to get him again. I gotta go to work. I, I knew that motherfucker was coming. <laughs> I knew that motherfucker was coming. <laughs> Hey, I told you when I go around that corner, I'm <laughs> With the damage front there, I did a bit around a bit. They <laughs> With the damage front there, bro, listen, it is, hey, I knew he was going to do it, though. That Because that's the spot. Like, once you once you come around that curve, it's like a straight shot, bro. You just, you just punch it every time and that I, that's why I, that's why I, you know i do what i do when i do what i do over there you know what i'm saying because it's just, it's just straight pull you know what i'm saying i heard that motherfucker because he hit it before he hit it before me but i was already ahead of him a little bit and i seen an opening so when i hit that opening it was go then he jumped back over and it was <laughs> that bit was on me but yeah gang i was telling the story about y'all so y'all watch the video. Y'all been watching the video, man. If you made this far to the video, thank you, bro. I'm trying to, we gotta run it up. But, uh, oh, buddy, he was on some bull, wasn't he? You talking like I did something to you, bitch ass boy. I'm like, bro. And then, what made me even matter was I calmed down and left it alone, let the, let the legal shit come about. You know what I'm saying? Okay, you say you got insurance, I got insurance. We gonna get, you, you at fault. Police say you at fault, let's go. Let's get it done. No, this nigga start talking, talking shit, talking about I'm clout chasing because I'm documenting. I'm like, bro, the fuck is you talking? First of all, you ain't got no clout. Who the fuck are you? Excuse my language. I'm gonna beep those out, but seriously, who are you, bro? That I gotta gain, I'm gaining clout off of you. I ain't never seen your YouTube channel. <laughs> or even know if you here locally recording, bro. So that was that was the main thing that pissed me out. Like, bro, you serious? You're old. I say you old, bro. What the fuck is you talking about? Clout. I'm talking about a fucking clout. You ain't no child, nigga. Stand on your feet. You admitted you wrong. You wrong. Let's get this doggy. Like, I wasn't even mad at that point. Okay, I know it's finna get fixed. Shout out to my boy Rami. He trying to tax me for a bumper though. Rami, if you watch this video, bro, come on. 800. Come on, man. Put your boy on the payment. <laughs> Ah, leave. So I'm gonna wait on insurance because Rodman won't fight. He told he he got a um. So y'all remember my Go Mango twin who upgraded? He went and got a wide body a wide body challenge and um. But before he put the wide body kit on uh, he had he was a uh, uh before he got the wide body kit on his Daytona he had it was, it was just like mine it was just an 18 so it had the snorkels and shit on it. You know what I'm saying? And uh, Rami bought it. I guess Rami gave it to Rami. Rami bought it. B5 Rami. Look him up on Instagram. That boy be sliding. Young Gold Extraordinaire. You know what I'm saying? He be out here sliding that thing. Um, but he gave it to Rami. And Rami seen what happened last night. He, like, he kind of hit me up quick, too. And he said he had it. But he want 800 for the joint. The full assembly. I don't even know how much a bumper costs or anything. And I don't want to spend my money and then insurance, you know. Insurance be on don't want to take care of but his insurance got to take care of so when i get back to my office i'm gonna call i'm gonna call my insurance to see what's the necessary precautions for me to see what i gotta do because on some, on some real shit nah, i ain't trying to pay for nothing i shouldn't have to pay for nothing and then i found out my license suspended. that's where i'm actually coming from reinstating my license I didn't know my license was suspended i've been right bruh i went all the way to atlanta with a with a bad license bruh like I tell y'all know on them highways what we do when we do what we do. Like, pff, killing it. If I'd have got, but we know, if I'd have got pulled, it would have been bad. But like I told y'all, no tag, no license, stretch game. <laughs> Big, big stress game, you know. But yeah, man, so I got a few things to take care of so I can get my um, shit back to running right. I'm finna pop out and show y'all what this thing look like. Y'all seen it, but it was dark, so you can see it in the daytime. You know, I should have just stopped and got me some lunch, but I didn't. Man, that was fun, though. I'm like, I'm, hey, 
He knew I was from the smash shop, bro. <laughs> he knew it, dog. He knew it. I like that. So, uh, there was a car in front of me. So when I looked at, like, if y'all watch the GoPro footage, or you gonna see the GoPro footage, watching the GoPro footage, there was a car in front of me. So I knew, like, by him moving faster than me, I wasn't gonna get to that hole before him. So he would have had to go, then I would have been able to get over. But his lane stayed clear for a longer period of time, so he was able to stay there. I, I'd have had a uh-uh one time, but that was lit. <laughs> but yeah, man, I'm going to get back at y'all. Well, yeah, I'm going to get back at y'all. So yeah, again, y'all see in the front right there. But it's all, it's, it's just this. Like, nothing hit the radiator, nothing. Even, even the, um, like, how he backed up, I guess because the truck was so high, it just dug into that. He ain't even hit this part, but you know, all that's, that's all one. You know what I'm saying? So, all that shit got to get good. I talked, to, I talked to the side customers, they said, here, he told me once I get the new one here, we wrap it, no problem. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's it's crazy though, like buddy, you fucked up, right? You did that and you caught an attitude with me. He was lucky because when I first hopped out of the car, I was like, I was on, I was on like some eight shit, like I was gonna slap that butt. And, he, and then he 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 was like, hold on, hold on, hold on. I got good insurance. I got insurance. Don't worry about it. I got insurance. Don't worry. I'm like, shh. You better say something. Then took a deep breath, walked around, looked, and I was like. Oh, look at my car! Look at my motherfucking car! <laughs> Cause it hit me again that this shit had just happened. So he told me he was like, "Just calm down, you good? I got you." But he he stayed. Cause I took I, I got my phone now. I got my camera. I was like, I'm finna record this nigga. And I'm finna record me beating his ass. But he he was cool people about it. I just like I say. Whatever drug or whatever drinks he was on, bro. Why are you driving? I tell him like, bro, why are you driving right now? I say, aside from this car, bro. What if you kill somebody because you fucking fall asleep behind the wheel, bro? Like that was my whole thing. I thought calm down. I was like, I said you could have killed somebody. Ride around intoxicated off medication, whatever it is, bro. Just sit the fuck down. Nobody can't go get you no food, bro. I don't know what to tell you. You risking everybody else's life. Like, what if you had a big-ass dude truck, you just rolled into my shit the hard way, you know? So, 